guys. So today I am so excited to share something with you that honestly, I never thought we would do this when we first started Huda Beauty. I am obsessed with false lashes. You guys know this. I have been obsessed with lashes. I've always wanted lashes, never had them as a kid. So today I'm revealing something that I kind of can't believe that it's actually happening. And that is mascara. Mascara is something that I've been working on for about five years. Actually, when we first launched makeup, which was in 2016, we had started already working on mascara previously. And I was just like, this is just not gonna work. Like my needs for lashes are just so big, so intense that I just can't see me ever choosing mascara over false lashes. I want long, pretty lashes. I know I pushed everyone very, very hard, but I am so beyond proud of what we are launching today. I wanna show you guys a small story. A couple years ago, about almost three years ago now, uh, two and a half years ago, I was sitting with three people from Sephora and I asked them, what's your favorite mascara? What's your favorite mascara? What's your favorite mascara? Three girls, right? One of them liked the Better Than Sex, one of them liked Benefit, and another one liked the Lancome one. And they were all best-selling mascaras. And I was like, okay, I'm so happy to hear that you love these. I also love these mascaras. And I said, okay, now I want you to try this mascara working on. And every single one of them loved our mascara. They were like, holy shit, what is this? And ever since then, they kept asking us, Where, when is the mascara launching? When is the mascara launching? When is the mascara launching? The mascara is so, it's so like personal, right? It depends on your density. It depends on how many lashes you have. It depends on the length. It depends on the curl. It's almost like hair on your, on your face. And I really, my dream was to do one that would work on everybody, no matter their lash type. And I truly feel like we did that. I want to tell you guys a little bit about my lash journey because I think it's really important to kind of explain. So I grew up a very hairy girl. I had mustache, goatee, unibrow all that's cool by the way no no shade against any of it but i grew up with no lashes i looked to my sisters even my brother and they all looked very feminine with those beautiful lashes and i just didn't have it and i just i was like i feel like if i had lashes i would look like a girl and i always felt like because of my mustache and everything that i look like a boy i remember one of my biggest first experiences with lashes like just knowing how dramatic i wanted them i remember seeing this ad and it was a beautiful ad and the girl had like beautiful lashes and i basically took the ad and i, I took it into a store and i was like oh my god i want this girl's lashes i want them give me the mask I tried every mascara under the sun. I was 19 at the time. And the guy at the counter was like, these are false lashes, you know that. And I was like, no, 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 it's the mascara ad. He was like, these are false lashes. And I was like, what? And that's kind of when my false lash addiction kind of started. I was like 19 at the time. It was like 17 years ago. It's been a long time. When it came to mascara, getting the perfect like set of lashes was just so hard. It was so hard to do. What I basically felt like I needed was like two mascaras. I needed a really volumizing mascara. Then I needed a lengthening one and that's apply multiple layers. Like it just took so long. And for me, the impact just wasn't the same as applying false lashes. So five years ago, when we started working on our mascara, we were like, what do we do? How are we going to do this? We want something that is going to be so intense. It's going to be so powerful that I don't want to be that brand that releases a new mascara every year. And there's no problem with doing that. But I just wanted something that could live a little, like have its own legs. It could live a little long. I, I was so excited to reveal this to you guys, but I feel so good about it. I can't wait to put it on and to show you guys how beautiful it is. But here is it. Here it is. Ah! I can't believe I just showed you guys. It is called Legit Lashes. And I want to tell you guys a lot behind the name and also the campaign. Because our campaign, my team came up with the most beautiful ideas. They were like, oh, we should do this we should do that and I was like you know what I love a beautiful campaign you guys know I do but I just I wasn't feeling it I was like you know what after we just we just finished wishful wishful was all about being raw it was all about like you know no photoshop no makeup I felt so good about that I was like I'm kind of on this high and I, I feel like this need for rawness and realness so the mascara campaign for legit lashes was really just about the mascara we don't need the fancy campaign we don't need the beautiful images and all the craziness all we need is the before and the after that's it. The only asterisk we have is no Photoshop or lash extensions used in this app. That's all we want. So on here, you can see it says you deserve the best lashes and we legitimately swear to give you major volume and to always provide dramatic curl and insane length. I was on this like spin. I was just so frustrated with all the old campaigns and all this stuff. I told my team about it last year. And then they were writing like all this, like this manifesto about being real, about like our ads being real and everything being true. And so they came up with this and I just, I really loved it. It talked to me like on so many deep levels. You guys know, I always want everyone to feel really beautiful. It's really, really important. But some of those like perfect ads and everything being Photoshopped almost felt like very uninclusive because like none of us were represented there. So this is like, this is truth. This is real. This is for everyone. You're going to see the before and afters. We have all all of our beautiful team members in them and hopefully you guys will feel really sexy with this so this is the package and on the back it has a before and after and what is this this kind of shows you what's inside now this mascara is not like every other mascara i'm going to show you guys really quickly 
this is it oh my god i'm so nervous i'm kind of shaking showing you guys this this is actually two mascaras in one it's not one mascara with two br two brushes it's actually two mascaras so there's a formula here and a brush and there's a formula here and a brush and each side has 8.5 milliliters which is about the size of a lot of mascaras two mascaras in one it's the best way to get awesome lashes that's what i've learned that's what i've noticed through the years and that's what that's the only thing that we could create for huda beauty being our first mascara when it came to naming the mascara like we were like what are we going to name it because like, do we name it the one and only since it's going to be the only one? Do we name it like something sexual? A lot of brands use like very sexual things like to get a lot of hype. And like all the names were kind of taken when it came to like the sexual names. We are like, what do we do? We don't really want that. We want something that is just really like based on the legitimacy of these lashes being like so legit. Too legit, like too awesome, too perfect. And the ads are real, like everything being real. So that's why we call it legit lashes. Okay, so let me show you guys how it is. It is a diamond shape, which for me is very ergonomic. So when you apply it, it works really, it just fits really nicely in the hand. You have on the back this volume side and the curl and length side it's labeled there and then each side kind of tells you how much is the weight that is inside and also the color the color is very vanta vanta essentially is like the blackest black it absorbs light it's so black that it actually absorbs light and our liner which i don't know if you guys saw all the pictures like we compared all the liners it was insanely black which is why we called it very vanta and this is kind of like the same deal it's super super intense black so i'm going to show you guys now the brushes i'm going to start first with the volume side and you can see we have a rubber applicator. I'm obsessed with this. And we basically, we made it customized to where you have like this little tip here and you can kind of like do a little shaping when you apply the mascara. And you can see the bristles here. Guys, I'm sorry, I'm shooting these from quarantine, this video from quarantine on my phone, so hope you guys can see it. I'll include the blog post so you guys can see all the close-up pictures, um, but this is essentially how it looks. And then on the lengthening side, you have like this it, like little kind of thing. It looks a little bit like a, like it pulls your lashes out. Both of the formulas have fibers and both of them have different fibers. And they also have different things inside of them to make sure that they give you extra length. So they actually do make your lashes look much longer. It was so interesting. Oh my gosh, when we were working with fibers, I couldn't believe how complicated fibers are. There's so many shapes, there's stars, there's hearts, there's different lengths. And actually getting that right took a long time, but we really did master it. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply it, but you can see on the packaging, the before and afters of using both mascaras, we recommend using volume first and then lengthening. And you can see, of course, these images legit before and after. Sean Hood is real lashes, not like a model with amazing lashes with no editing. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab it. And as I apply it, I am going to make sure that I apply it really quickly. I don't like to let the, the um, layer set. So I'm gonna start first with the volume side. And we're off. You can see immediately. The thing I love about this is like you can work it for a long time, but you really don't have to. Like immediately, kapam. I never thought I would not wear false lashes and actually for the first time ever, I, I've been wearing mascara and that's it. And I feel really really sexy and really beautiful and ideally we're not going to cut these edits so you guys can just see it all the way through that was really fast i didn't need to work the mascara i'm going now to the lengthening side and again i don't want to edit this ideally so you guys can get the full effect if you were applying it how would it work And also in the link that I'm gonna put for the blog, we'll show you how it looks with just the volume and just the length, and then you'll see the difference of the two together and it really does make a difference. The great thing about this is like, you don't need to like spend forever on your lashes. Yeah, how long did that take? Not long. I'm gonna quickly just apply on the bottom as well. Um, I do like to apply on the bottom, but sometimes I feel like I just like to clean off the brush tip a little bit. And I just use this bit right here. My lashes get so long with this mascara that I actually, I get worried about the tips hitting my face and I never used to have that problem before. Sometimes I use just the volume side for the bottom of my lashes. <laughs> um, I don't know if you guys can see the difference. It's 
pretty insane. It took like no time to get this. Like this is just, this is insanity. Before when I wanted lashes like this, it would either have to be false lashes, very natural looking lashes, or it would literally take me forever to get this. Like this took me no time. I'm so confident that this is going to be everyone's favorite mascara. I'm gonna quickly do the other eye and I'm gonna come back in two seconds. Oh, I am so obsessed with this mascara. Like literally, I love my lashes so much. I never in a million years thought I would ever feel comfortable in my own lashes, with my own lashes, without false lashes, with a mascara. And I never thought it would be this easy too. I wanna tell you guys a little bit about the formula because it's really important to explain why this mascara is so intense. And I also wanna tell you guys, of course, about the claims behind this because we did some claims tests and we were so overwhelmed with the results. So the reason why this mascara is so intense, you get that immediate intensity as soon as you apply the brush against your lashes is because we have a wax that basically grips your lashes and it basically coats the entire lash the whole way through. So, so this wax immediately goes and it adheres to your lashes right away so you get that super intensity as soon as you apply it. This wax also does not weigh your lashes down. So if you're somebody who has sparse lashes like myself, you're going to still get that lift and that intensity and you're not gonna lose any of your lashes. Sometimes when mascaras are really heavy or the waxes are really heavy, it kind of just like adds a lot of intensity but you don't necessarily have the lift and you really want both. You want the volume and you want the lift. We also have fibers that are five millimeters long and getting that length was super important. But basically the fibers are just long enough to actually make your lashes look like you have a lash lash extension kind of appearance. So let's talk about the claims because that will kind of talk to you a little bit about this lash extension appearance. So 100% of people actually said that they thought that they looked like they had lash extensions on. 100% of people also believe that their lashes look more curled and more length. And 100% of people also believe that it looked like they had more lashes, just more intensity of lash hairs. That's amazing. As you guys know, the link down below is for the blog post. It will give you all the details for all the claims. I hope you guys can just see for yourselves. Um, and we didn't edit it while I was applying, at least on this eye, so you guys could kind of see the effect and how intense and how fast it was. So I can't wait for you guys to try this. I hope everyone loves it. I hope everyone feels that this is a mascara for them because we truly put all of our heart and soul into making sure that every single person who tried it, no matter your lash density, your lash curl, your lash length, no matter what the situation is, no matter how sparse your lashes are, you are going to feel really sexy and really beautiful because everyone deserves that. I love you guys so much. I can't wait for you guys to try this and I'll see you guys so soon. Love you guys.